My name is Irene Balelli. I am a research scientist working at Inria Sofia Antipolis uh, in the APION team. I am uh, in charge of um, uh, leading uh, the, the group dedicated to in silico trials uh, and data science. So with the objective of uh, designing and performing uh, in silico trials for each of the selected use cases uh, on a standardized uh, cloud-based uh, platform and also of exploring uh, several possible contexts of use um, of the simulations and uh, finally of um, exploiting uh, the in silico generated data. I think that uh, uh, the work that we will be carried on in this group and uh, the expected results um, are uh, key within the project uh, SIM card test uh, um, overall objectives. And by the way, it will need uh, uh, to gather the efforts uh, of all partners. So in particular, it will answer to one of, of the main objectives of the SIM card test, uh, which is to uh, set up a secure and standardized framework for cardiac uh, modeling and simulation and also to uh, prove that uh, in silico approaches can uh, actually create uh, scientific evidence can help uh, them overcoming uh, clinical trial limitations. Silico trials and data science group has uh, just started uh, working uh, since, uh, let's say we needed first to have the cardiac models at an enough nature and stable form. And so the first step uh, we are working on uh, well, in, in particular, um, our partners from uh, InSilico Trials Company uh, is uh, the orchestration uh, of uh, the platform to be used uh, for performing all simulations. And um, so in particular, uh, dedicated interfaces for each uh, use cases are being set up. Uh, so according to the different modeling modules and the expected inputs, outputs data, and this will be the main activity during uh, uh, 2022. And then, of course, other phases will follow. I will say that, that the activity uh, for the NCDECO trials and data science group can be uh, roughly divided into three main blocks. So the first one, um, as I said, uh, is the orchestration of the cloud-based platform, which has already started. Then, uh, second phase, we will be able to properly design uh, um, and run uh, in silico trials for each use case, so facing leads and catheters, left after as well appendage of cloud and drugs, exploring so different scenarios and clinical questions. Finally, so at a more advanced stage, um, we will investigate always in silico uh, more challenging scenarios, such as, for instance, drugs device interaction or also some uh, specific, very specific codes. And we will deploy some advanced data science techniques to perform a more in-depth analysis, statistical analysis of the generated data. And for instance, uh, potentially discover some new biomarkers of interest. The SIM card test project is part uh, of a series of initiatives which aim to promote uh, the use of in silico methodologies uh, to assist and improve uh, um, clin clinical trials and the healthcare innovation uh, in general. And uh, in our specific case, uh, we are focusing on uh, cardiac pathologies, uh, which are, by the way, one of the main uh, causes of mortality worldwide. And um, the, the objective is so to demonstrate that in silico trials can actually contribute uh, to provide more adequate and efficient and personalized uh, therapies. Uh, so from development up to commercialization. I think that, that computer modeling and simulations and uh, in silico methods in general uh, are uh, um, increasingly adapted and trusted for a, a broad range of applications in medicine, uh, such as, uh, for instance, uh, to increase uh, the quality and the reliability of clinical trials results, uh, while, by the way, reducing and the time and the costs. Um, and also to improve personalization of medical interventions and, uh, and finally to, to, assist, uh, the, the really, uh, to assist the medical daily practice. I'm truly convinced of the uh, interest uh, uh, for, uh, for healthcare innovation and so for, the, uh, for increasing the uh, people quality of life and expectation of life.